Hi everybody, Cam McGregor here from River Escapes Guided Fly and Lure Fishing in North East Victoria and Southern New South Wales. I want to have a chat with you today about a new lure to the Tide Tackle Range and a new one for Megabass as well, and that's the Big M 2.0. Now it builds on the pedigree that a lot of good switched on cod anglers already know how effective they are. Those two lures are the Big M 7.5 and the 4.0. Now they, these numbers correspond to how, how deep that lure can dive for you on a good cast. 2.0, big M, as the name suggests, gets down to two meters. Now, a lot of switched on cod anglers are probably already thinking, oh, I really want a lure that's gonna dive deeper for me. Now, you need to break it down a bit here and think about it. It's, it's a lure that's gonna fish specific depth ranges for us very well. This water I'm in here today, beautiful, clear, essentially upland river, a lot of the fish in here are holding on logs that at the, at the most are only in three meters of water or less. Now, when they're parked up in their log, they're in shallower water again. So we want a lure that runs over the top of them without crash diving in, and that's where the 2.0 comes into it. Another great, great area for this lure is, like mark my words, my whale is gonna be Weed City again this year. So we want a lure that can effectively run around the edges of the weed beds. The 2.0 is gonna be great for us there as well. Another great spot for it's going to be, think of, think of we, we now know how important that these shallow flats areas or lakes are as feeding areas and as the weather warms, a lot of the bait, like redfin, pushes up into the shallows. So they're basically in there getting ready to spawn themselves and they, then they're going to start feeding in that bit, little bit warmer water. Now if you're fishing a flat area that might even max out to four metres deep where you're sitting in your boat and you might be casting up into a shallower edge and working it out, if you've got a lure that runs at two metres, it's gonna be tracking back above the fish. Now, think about it too, Murray Cod's eyes are on top of their head, so they're a fish that loves to feed from wherever they're sitting up to the surface. So if you've got a lure that's running more mid-water column, it's gonna be an easy target for that fish to pick up. Now, the red fin color in the Big M, in the three model Big M's, is specific to ebb tide tackle in Australia. So think of that one. No one else has got this lure apart from the ebb tide guys. Now, why red fin color scheme? Like I said, Murray Cod love to feed on redfin when they're available as a food source. Unfortunately, they've essentially taken over in a lot of our waterways and they've filled the, the void as far as food where a lot of our smaller native fish should have been. Now, <clears throat> every water in every waterway in Victoria where there's Murray Cod, there's also redfin available as food. And there's a hell of a lot, hell of a lot of lakes and rivers up into New South Wales that now unfortunately have big populations of redfin, but the cod are capitalising on them. They're never gonna eat them out, but they're definitely gonna keep feeding on them themselves. So, remember that one. That redfin color scheme to me has been a standout for me for years in my custom cod flies. A lot of people will tell you that color doesn't mean anything for Murray Cod. I, I feel in a lot of specific situations it definitely plays a part, especially clear water situations that I fish, fish with clients a lot, be it impoundments or rivers like I'm on today. I feel where fish have got longer to look at a potential food item, being your lure, I have a lot more confidence in what's tied on the end of the rods if, it, if I feel it looks more natural to the fish. Now, remember, clear water impoundments like Eildon, same, sort, same deal. Those fish are really gonna key in on your lure for longer. Even if color doesn't mean anything, think of it from your point of view. If you've got 100% confidence that you're throwing something that looks like food to the fish, you're gonna fish it a lot more confidently. So remember, the Ebb Tide Tackle have the Big M 2.0 in their exclusive redfin color now to complement the two other dive depths. Keep us in mind for your fishing adventures this season. Anyone wants to catch up any, any form at the moment online or give us a phone call, we're more than welcome to have a chat and plan your next adventure. I can tell you now that the rivers are shaping up to be in great condition come December again for Murray Cod opening. We're getting some really good inflows now. We're going to have plenty of water to play on. And we've got Eildon as well in the spring this year. Remember, it doesn't close, so we can get you out on there as well. Thanks for listening. Keep that lure in mind. See ya. Big M 2.0, 4.0, and 7.5. At 126 mil in length, put it this way. In my other life as a fisheries researcher, if I had a dollar for every 126 millimeter redfin I've measured over the years, I'd be a much richer man. Essentially, that size range matches a huge part of the redfin population in our lakes and rivers in southeastern Australia. How's that finish?